2009 has been a bad year for the flu outbreak and a terror-stricken year for the infamous H1N1 virus, also known as the swine flu. While people's fear of the H1N1 virus may have dissipated, there have been a few outbreaks at a local school such as North Country Elementary and Wilson C. Riles Middle School. With the likelihood of more outbreaks, there is a chance of the virus coming to our own campus. Center High School is in contact with the Center for Disease Control constantly and for very good reason. You know, this virus is going to hit like any other flu. Uh, it, it's just a matter of time before it's on our campus. The main thing to be uh, to keep in your mind is it's not a reason to panic. It's just like any other flu. Uh, the Center for Disease Control is in contact with us uh, constantly. Uh, the State Department of Education is in contact with us constantly. We're in contact with the Sacramento Department of Health. Some fear the flu could reach epidemic proportions which may force safety precautions like quarantines or worse. Shutting down the school would be absolute worst case scenario. Uh, it appears that the vast majority of people who are already in, in good health are, are just dealing with this flu like any other flu. You know, they're over it in a few days. Uh, you know. Last year, I think some schools closed down just because we didn't, we weren't really sure in this country what the what this virus is going to do. And uh, now we have a little bit better understanding of what's going on. I, I don't foresee us uh, closing down. There are simple precautions we can take to help prevent the spreading of the virus. Wash your hands. Use hand sanitizer. Uh, don't share, you know, drinks. Don't share eating utensils. Uh, try and cover your coughs and sneezes. Uh, it's no, it's spread just like any other flu. Uh, it's going to go around. There's nothing extraordinary that you need to do besides the normal things you do during a normal flu season. The CFC says if they get more than five cases of swine flu in two weeks, they may recommend to shut down the school. The chance of getting the H1N1 is going to be dangerously high, but don't panic. Don't be surprised if someone at center gets the flu. The easiest way to protect against the spread of the H1N1 virus is to stay home when you're sick. Swine flu or not, you should still stay home when you're sick. I'm reporting for CTV News. This is Kevin from Tuscapon.